Well, welcome back. Charlene Patton with the Kansas Soybean Commission is with us this morning to teach us how to make a yummy recipe, an edamame and walnut salad. Good morning, Charlene. Good Thank morning. you so much for being with us. So talk to me about this salad and what we're making this morning. Well, the month of of May here, we're featuring salads. Oh, lovely, yes. And it just seems like, you know, as it get, the weather gets warmer, we like to have lighter meals. Oh, yes. And so we have some great recipes that we're featuring. The edamame and walnut salad is just a, I don't know, look at those colors Look at there. that. Yes. Perfect for spring into summer. <laughs> That's Gorgeous. Right. I'm going to have you start okay, with yes. the dressing here and look at all these wonderful mm -hmm. ingredients that we're going to do. We're you starting out with extra virgin olive oil, but like I was telling you, this recipe comes to us from the Soy Foods Council. Yes. But I would like to also use the uh, vegetable right. oil because that's our soybean product Absolutely. from here. So you could use either one, and I've already put this in. You could put it in a, a bowl to mix it with a whisk. Okay, yes. But I've got this container that you can just shake and nice it and makes nifty. it easier yes. to do it. So to that, we're going to add some brown sugar okay. there. And then I did grate some fresh ginger. And yes. the ginger root you will find in the produce section of your grocery store. Okay. Take out that outer edge and then grate it. And you're going to want the fresh kind. Perfect. That's right. Well, it adds a lot more flavor oh, yes, to it. it and then we have some seasoned mm -hmm. salt. And then you can smell this. This is balsamic vinegar. Oh, yes. And it said you can use a, some choices of vinegar in there. And then you see that little piece that went in mm -hmm. there? That was a little <laughs> bit of Dijon mustard. Okay, wonderful. So lots nice of and flavor. Zingy too. And I'm going to make sure we get that nice and tight mm -hmm. for you. And we'll make sure that that's down and closed. Yes, perfect. I'll let you okay. shake that. I'll get to it. <laughs> and then here we have oranges. And it gives you a couple of choices. You can use two cans of the mandarin okay. oranges. Or if you have fresh oranges, then um, section those out and you could use fresh yes. oranges. So that's all there is. We're just going to oh, mix lovely. that with our edamame that's Make cooked. Sure this is nice Pour cheap, some of that. Okay. I'll let you just, probably not oh. all of it because it makes a lot of it. Yeah, okay. just, just that's like great. That. Okay. Just okay. drizzle. You tell me when, Shirley. All right. We'll drizzle some of that on there. I think that's perfect. Wonderful. Mix that up, and then when you serve it, mm -hmm. it, it we've roasted some walnuts. Oh, for a nice little crunch yes, in there. and so. we'll just put that on top. Yum. Oh, such a great salad, and I have one on display there, and it makes a great salad to serve. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for being with us this morning, Charlene. If you missed any of that, it'll, of course, be on our website. That's kwmnewsnow.com. Stick around. We'll be back with more after this.